What's going on, everyone? Hi, everybody. Hi. She's in the back. Hi. <laughs> we got Daniel here. Daniel's here, and we're doing uh, another. Is that Daniel's hair? Yeah. Daniel. Is crazy. That, is this like like Snow Lord's beard or this? Or this? What, what do you call it? His accessories, right? That was nasty. <laughs> oh, yeah. Daniel's comb. Daniel's comb. <laughs> yeah. We're back with the stories from the road. Uh, got to catch up with Daniel for a little bit. And he's got a little story about an accident. Uh, so we will talk about this crazy accident. I think I've heard this story before, but it's, it's a pretty good one. So let's get started. You can tell this guy's story. All right. Yeah. All right. So we are back with Daniel. Adami, if you want to check out this dude's channel, we'll put it up above. He's got some pretty good stories on there too, but he's telling one story now about an accident on the road. Let's hear it, Bob. Yeah, what's up, guys? Of course, you y'all know my name is Daniel Adami here. We um, got a story from back in December 21st of 2013. Happened five, almost almost six years now. So uh, I was in the oil field at the time. And uh, <laughs> yeah, at the time I wasn't oil field. So at the time, money was good. Lows were were, were real good. On the oil yeah. field, did you, did yeah. you ride with a uh, RVT? Stop it! Stop it! Okay, we won't talk about that. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I have no idea who that was. I just ruined the story. Now he's got. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I have no idea who that was at the time. I don't, know. I don't yeah. either. I just made it up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so it was around. Let's see. I was in a small town called York, Texas, just southeast of uh, of uh, San Antonio on US 87. Oh, no, no. It was close to that highway, US 87. But I was on Texas 114. I think it was that one. Well, anyways. Um, He's more familiar with that area. I'm just, I don't know anything over there. <laughs> I-10, yeah. that's it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I was headed, I think it was like north, like west, northwest, somewhere around that area. It was around 3 o'clock in the morning. And it, uh, it had just finished raining. It wasn't raining anymore. So this is a, it was a brand new Ford F-450. It was hauling a thousand gallons of red dye diesel fuel. He was heading towards the same area as I was. But he was about maybe, I want to say a good, thousand feet in front of me and I, I've been through there many times you know delivering uh, sand and all that stuff like the fracking food. stuff yeah fracking. Okay. it was called bayright it was actually going to the actual rigs that drilled the holes and all that stuff oh, okay okay yeah um well anyways this guy like I said it just started finished raining and the road was uh it was a two-lane road one that way one this way no shoulders everything so like I said he was in front of me and I knew about this one curve, it was a big curve, it was like an S-curve. But the first one was kind of big and the other one wasn't as tight as this first one. And I didn't see this guy slowing down for anything. And so he hit a slick spot, you know, because those are crude oil trucks that go through there also. Yeah. And I guess so a lot of those trucks do, they do leak a lot of oil. So, nice. so y'all know oil and water don't mix. So that oil created a slick spot. It comes to the top, don't yeah. it? Yeah, so it was slick. So he was going, and his back end started doing this crap. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, then that's when he started putting his brakes and stuff. And that just what kind of caused him to start swerving some more. He was fish telling. And now, by then, before he started doing that, I already I was already slowing down. So he's like sliding, coming towards you. No, he was. We we're going the same way. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay. He was going the same way. And like I said, before he's before we get to that. Before he got to that, that curve, I was already slowing down because I already knew about that curve. Well, not curve, but curve and and everything. And then saw him fish tanning some more and he got to the other end of the, uh, on the other side of the curve. And then finally his his drive tires, they caught the uh, the gravel on the opposite side. And he shot across Damn. and uh, and he rolled over. Oh, yeah, yeah. he actually rolled over and this this passenger side was was crushed, and you would think that driver's side would be crushed because he rolled on onto his driver's side. But what he said, he was like this. He's, he was like this, holding on. That part wasn't even crushed. Wow. Nothing happened to him. But when I was, when that was happening, 
I, I guess I hit the same slick spot. Oh, man, here we go. And, <laughs> and like I said, I was already slowing down, but when I saw that, I, I panicked and I slammed on my brakes, you know. And my truck just did this, it jacked my trailer kept going straight. I weighed about 77, 78,000 pounds. So, because they, they put us like 44,000 pounds of, uh, of that bay ride. And uh, so, my truck did this. My trailer just kept going. Just pushing and, it. Yeah. And it, it hit back here. I guess it couldn't go anymore. So, then I did this and I just went to a ditch. Oh, damn. Yeah. Uh, but the bad thing is, right there where I landed, there was a house right there. And if that ditch wasn't there, and there's also a tree. If it wasn't there, I would have killed an elderly couple that slept in that very corner of that house and everything. Just and it because, was bad. Just because somebody else yeah. fought the equipment and here you guys come and <laughs> Yeah. Well, not that his equipment was faulty. Well, yeah, the, it was brand all new. the trucks before you. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. Because those Damn. crude oil trucks leak and all that stuff. and So, uh, so yeah, that's what happened. You know, after I landed, I didn't even care about what happened to me. Yeah, I knew I, I jerked. I almost hit the, the windshield. My my fire extinguisher was uh, right here, but on the driver's side, right next to the door, wow. and it, it landed on this side. Yeah, and uh, and I, at the time I used to smoke, and I had my my lighter on the on the door handle right here. It landed on the other door handle. What? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it was weird how that happened. But yeah, I, like I said, I didn't care what happened to me. I just, I got out of my truck and I ran towards him to make sure he was okay. Cause he, he was, cause he, he rolled was. over and stuff. I just want to make sure away, he was okay. Huh? Yeah, he walked away wow. clean. No, no broken bones, his nothing, no scratch. His truck was all messed up too. Yeah, his yeah. truck was messed up. What about yeah. yours? Was he able to drive away? I mean, no, obviously no. not you're in a ditch, but. No, my, my truck was total. Wow. Total, I mean complete, total. Yeah, the, the back in the sleeper end, it came off the, came off the frame. Oh damn! Yeah, and uh, had a ru uh, ruptured uh, fuel say. tank on the passenger side. Oh stuff. really? Yeah. Oh, damn. So, Were you out of work for a while? I mean. Oh yeah, I was up for at least a month and a half. Like, yeah. Where did, you, did you get like injured or? No, I didn't. Get, I didn't get injured. Just so it was, it was all adrenaline. You know, oh. stuff what happened. So the other dude, he, the other guy, he was all right. Yeah, he was wow, all right. That's yeah. crazy. Two trucks wrecked. You would think one person's gonna die, unfortunately. But damn, yeah. Both of you walked away. Yeah. yeah. Obviously, you walked away. Just yeah. kind of bumped and bruises and whatnot. But damn, that's freaking. I couldn't even. There's been a couple times where I like, you know, we always, you know, try. You, know, you always say like, if something happens, like, don't hit the brake or don't panic. And I was like Kansas City, and like I drove through like just a tiny, you know, black ice. I was only doing like. 15 miles an hour and then all of a sudden the trailer just, yeah. just starts going yeah. you know, and everything was cool and nothing happened it just caught and came back over thank yeah. god but it was just you never know man people that's I, I would assume that's how stuff happens people panic you know yeah. first con, you know, reaction just hit the brakes and you know yeah that, that's what exactly what happened to me I put I just slammed on my brakes I don't know what to do that was my first time ever being in a jackknife yeah. uh, position and I didn't know what to do I was I started driving in 2007. That happened in 2013. Well, that's six years, well, almost seven years in my career. Everything, and, and I panicked and stuff. So, so yeah. So listen, when you start jackknifing, do not hit the brakes. What they Just say? turn the way your truck is going and press on the gas. gas. Let, no, let go of the gas first and let let those wheels stop uh, spinning. Uh. And then once it stops spinning, then that's when you press on the gas again. I heard, that's like, correct it. I heard that it's like what you do, like once you, you know, get it somewhat correct, like, you know, give it gas and, you know, hit the trailer rig. That's what I heard yeah. too, so. Yeah. Uh, it's I, probably sure. different in any situations. It's going to be, you know, different, but, man. Yeah. You just never know what's going to happen. That's crazy. I'm glad you walked away from that and the other guy, man. That, oh, yeah. I'd hate to hear anything crazy like that, but, uh. Yeah. Another crazy story. Yeah. Didn't we say the last time we were going to tell a, a fun story? Yeah, we just, we've had like three, like, oh, stories in there. <laughs> <laughs> next one will be a good one, I promise. <laughs> I don't yeah. know if Pellarider's the next one. Oh, yeah, Pellarider's got a story coming up. That's going to be a good one. Yeah. 
It's probably about something about taking a shower with Ike Stevens or something. Maybe we don't want to tell that story, but that's... What part of no drama on this channel are no, you not understanding? That was no, a drama. That's not drama. That's actual, that was, that uh, was legitimate, actually, but, for real. That was the truth. A true story. Stop. He's not here to defend himself. We'll ask him. We'll ask him when he's sitting right here, and yep. he will say... He'll yes. say, you're crazy. Yeah, he'll say it. that's crazy. <laughs> he said it in, in I think one of his live videos. No, yeah. Live piece too. Oh, yeah. so. <laughs> that was funny. Nice. Yeah. Alright guys, we gotta get out of here. He's gotta yeah. go. I gotta go. So she's headed go. that way. She I'm wants to go. Way. Where are we going? Where's me? It's crazy with everything that Daniel, you know, he he forgot to mention in the video. He told me later that the company that he helped out the guy that had the accident accident, he they actually offered him a job, just like from what he did, helping the other driver, you know, just, that, that, that's crazy, it's crazy how, you know, a bad situation turns into something good, you know, yeah, that's a pretty crazy way to get a job offer, yeah. <laughs> but hey, you know, we'll take yeah, what we can get. that's it, that's it, uh, appreciate you guys watching, if you're interested in telling your story, you know, check out the comments below, you know, the you can, description below. In the description below, you can track me down, so we can we can catch up. I mean, we can do. Uh, you know, I like to do this. You know, it seems like it's a pretty good little thing so far. Uh, you know, we can do it face to face, which is the best way. You know, we can do it over the phone. You know, whichever is you know best for you. Just let me know if you want to do it. I think it'd be a pretty cool thing. Everybody's got a story to tell, and we want to hear it. So, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys next time. Stories from the road? Bye. She's ready to go. Let's get out of here. Oh. Bye. You know, a minute of like her laughing or something like that. She's like, you're dumb. <laughs> right? <Nope. laughs>